just arrived in Vatican City. It's a whole nother country, as Courtney loves to point out. Wow, Courtney. Doesn't really feel like Here it, with though. Megan. And uh, Mateusz is doing something else today because he's coming here in like two months, so he didn't want to spoil it for himself. He said he wants to keep some mystery for himself. <laughs> yes, the man of mystery, Mateusz. That should be his Instagram name. Yeah, it should be. Um, so yeah, we're just going to check out the museum and then go to the Basilica and... I don't know, I'll probably have some terrible puns along the way. So, see you in the next clip. International or what? I won't say I mean love. Here we go. Headed into the Sistine Chapel now. Courtney's already there. She couldn't wait. She ran ahead, but... <laughs> what and I were taking time to appreciate the art. Yeah, so, anyway, see you guys there. experience so far hey, Megan? Honestly, I'm surprised by a lot of it. I didn't expect it to be I don't know the way it is. I just had different expectations. Yeah? Are you like pleasantly surprised or disappointed or I'm not either. I'm just I'm just surprised. It's okay. not good or bad. It's just not what I had in my mind, you know? When you see things on the internet and whatever it just is different than in real life. I see. Outside the Basilica di San Pietro, um, we just finished at the museum. You definitely weren't allowed to film in there, and they kept yelling at everyone with their cameras. But I managed to sneak in a few shots. And the whole the creation of Adam photo, that's super famous, where God touches Adam, is actually way smaller than I thought it would be. I was expecting it to be the entire roof, but it was quite small, way smaller than I thought. They totally blow it way out of proportions. It was still an absolutely beautiful museum. I really loved every part of it. And it was nice because it just wasn't one type of art. There was like a bunch of stones, bunch of paintings, bunch of modern paintings, and then like the beautiful rooms and everything. So I felt like it was like nice to go through. It's not like one art museum where you get bored of watching art the whole time. Anyway, we're just waiting in line to go. This is the biggest basilica in the world. And the line goes all the way around. So we may be here a little while. But uh, I'll see you guys on the inside. We made it through the line. Quick hour and 15 minutes later. And we are here. Up close, personal. About to go inside. Very excited.
catch you guys up from later. Okay, so as I was trying to say earlier, the Basilica was super awesome. The attention to detail was absolutely incredible. Every little nook and cranny which you carved out of stone, it was so beautiful. I, it blows my mind how someone's able to carve that marble or stone or whatever it is. In fact, I was looking at a painting and, well, what I thought was a painting and it turned out to be a huge mosaic, I'll show it on the screen here, it was absolutely incredible. There were thousands of little pieces all built together to make an incredible piece of art. I'm not sure when the Basilica was made. I'll also flash that on the screen, but it looks to be pretty modern. Um, and it was actually built over top of the tomb of the first ever Pope. But after we finished at the Basilica, we went to the Trevoli Fountain because Megan has not been here before. And we're trying to meet up with Mateusz, but no one has a phone plan, so we're not sure if he actually got our message or not. And if we meet him here, wonderful. And if not, I know he's just going to have to hang out by himself. But if anyone can hang out on their own and be completely fine, it's Mateusz. He's probably riding a Vespa on top of some rooftops with four other Italian men eating free pasta there. Anyway, after that, we're going to this other place, which name I will also throw up on the screen right now because I forget. I'm really bad at remembering all the names of the places we're going to, apparently. Courtney said she really wanted to throw a penny into the fountain, so you'll see that next, and then wherever we end up going to. Bye. <laughs> yeah, wrong shoulder. Really? Yeah! It's your, le your left, no. isn't it? It's my left shoulder. Yeah. I know, everyone's throwing it on the other side. I thought it was left. left. Oh no! Bad luck. Bad luck for the rest of my life. Doom. A few moments later. Tayush, you made it! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm impressed! I had no idea! I honestly did not think I'd ever see you again. <laughs> I'm like, it's the gang! Just made it to the Piazza Navona. We just got scared out of our boots. finished at some sort of immaculate conception church according to Courtney. I, I'll put the name up here if I can find it. And now it looks like we're walking through just a street with Christmas lights because everyone is in the spirit of Christmas. December 1st was yesterday so it's totally acceptable now. Hi Courtney, how are you doing back there? So yeah, um, we're just gonna enjoy our time here and then I'll see you guys after.